Auckland, I give the floor to the representative of the World Youth Alliance. Madam Chair, ladies and gentlemen, every person is a bearer of unique worth and capacities, making up the potential of society. As we review the ICPD's implementation, let us recognize our alignment with this fact. The World Youth Alliance is a coalition of young people across the world dedicated to promoting and protecting the dignity of all human beings through policy, culture, and education. We designed our Human Dignity Curriculum, which has continued to impact children ages 5 to 18, with an appreciation for the intrinsic and inalienable value that they possess from conception to natural death. The curriculum instills a context for personal identity rooted in the understanding that our universal human dignity obligates us to act in ways that respect it. During implementation, children have grown in character, affirming that regardless of their circumstance, they can develop their talents and contribute to the common good. We call for efforts towards a society where every human being sees their value and fosters a reason to respect the value of others. The family is the ex is the first experience of our of efforts towards the common good and where human creativity develops. We call for the promotion and protection of the family, creating an environment that nurtures potential into competence. We can do this using policies that provide targeted support for parents and promote a positive outlook on childbearing and rearing. Finally, social planning for purely economic purposes devalues human beings. We urge policymakers to recognize that true development enables every human person to live a meaningful life and the economy exists to serve the human flourishing, not vice versa. Thank you. I thank the representative of World Youth Alliance.